It's the United States' third move towards curbing immigration in just over a month. This year. On Wednesday, the Trump administration announced they were replacing a previous detention policy and that children could now be kept in custody indefinitely. At the heart of this new rule are two core principles, that families should remain together during immigration proceedings and that conditions for care of children must be appropriate. Up until now, migrant children could be kept in detention centers away from their parents for up to 20 days, a policy that the administration says encourages adults to bring children with them as they attempt to cross into the United States, hoping they'll be freed after the 20-day limit. Together with the wall, President Trump says the measures will stop migrants from crossing the border altogether. When they see you can't get into the United States or when they see if they do get in the United States, they will be brought back to their country. It won't matter if they get in or not because we're doing that. Uh, they won't come and many people will be saved. The new rule is set to take effect in 60 days' time, but is likely to be challenged by the courts. It comes after Mexico agreed to clamp down on migration, while Guatemala bowed down to pressure from the United States, demanding that migrants seek asylum there rather than at the US border.